Hey guys, it's Peter again. Welcome back to the channel. This video is going to be a review on Hikari Lionhead. A couple months ago, I got a 350 gram bag of it on Amazon for 15 bucks and thought that it was pretty worth it. My fish seemed to really enjoy it and switched to the new food immediately. Before this, I was feeding the purple sake Hikari bag which was much more expensive so I decided to give this a try. It comes in an airtight resealable package to keep the food fresh as long as possible. The pellets are the sinking kind and are small enough for most goldfish to eat without any trouble. With most sinking goldfish food, a lot of pellets end up floating but almost all Hikari linehead pellets sink to the bottom immediately. The pellets also keep their form in the water so I did not notice any problems with water cloudiness or foul smelling water. One thing I like to mention is that the food has a strong seafood smell to it. I noticed it at first but eventually it didn't really bother me. I fed this food 3 times a day and it lasted me almost exactly 4 months. You can watch my videos from June to see how my fish have developed on this food. One of the reasons I tried this product was to try and grow my ranchu's wen but I'm not really sure if it made a huge difference. I also like the fact that it is a high protein food which is perfect for overall fish growth during the summer months. I'll let you decide if my ranchu's wen and other goldfish have grown in the past 4 months. I think that they did. This food is also supposed to be a color enhancer like the purple sake hikari, but I think that it isn't as good in this aspect. My fish are still pretty vibrant, but I felt like the purple sake hikari brought out the reds much more. Now for the ingredients and guaranteed analysis. Ingredients are listed in order of predominance with the ingredients used in the greatest amounts first. The first few ingredients are fish meal, wheat flour, soybean meal, krill meal, and fish oil. For the guaranteed analysis, Hikari Lionhead has a minimum of 46% protein and 6% fat, and a maximum fiber of 5%. The high protein content targets good wen and overall growth in fancy goldfish. Overall, I really liked this food. It wasn't too expensive and I thought it was a high quality food for fancy goldfish. I never noticed any digestive problems or swim bladder issues in my goldfish with this food. I will definitely be buying more in the future. Have you tried this food out? Let me know in the comments below what you thought of it. Also let me know what your favorite goldfish food is and why. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.